In my opinion and my observation over the years, I can tell you that our top two reasons why most people fail is number one, they don't have mental models. A mental model is simply a way that you can make sense out of life, out of business, out of any abstract concept. So for example, if I said to you, do you know what influence means? You may have some sort of an idea what influence means. But if your idea is not specific, you will make bad decisions. Same thing with wealth. I can assure you that literally, if I spoke to 100 people and I said, what does wealth mean? I can assure you 100 out of 100 will not be able to tell me what wealth means. If I ask most, success, most people what success means, most people have no definition or clue about what success means. The problem is they think they know, but they actually don't know. So the problem is this. Imagine you're trying to hit a target that you cannot even see. How are you going to hit that target? The second reason, people don't have mental toughness. Most people, and please don't be offended, if you know my style, you know I'm extremely direct and truthful. Most people are weak. They are weak. They cannot handle challenges. They cannot handle conflict. They can, cannot handle problems. They cannot handle confrontation. They cannot handle situations. They cannot handle high performance. They cannot handle accountability. Most people are weak. I don't say this with any disrespect. You are talking to somebody who was one of the weakest people you'll ever meet. I was mentally weak, emotionally weak, spiritually weak, financially weak. So I know what it's like to be mentally tough. And mentally tough does not mean that you're insensitive. It doesn't mean that you don't care. In fact, mental toughness means that you care so much that you care about bigger things than your own feelings. Your feelings are important, but it is more important that you deliver what you've committed to. A lot of people don't have mental toughness and for this reason alone, they will fail. So many people will say to me, Ron, you put too much content. I'm the one that's doing the work and you're overwhelmed? So many people will say, oh my God, Ron, you put too much. Oh, Ron, you, it's too hard for me. I can't do a three hour event. I'm the one that's speaking at the three hour event and you can't even attend it. So many people will say three days is too much. You see, the problem is people do not have the capacity. They have not built the capacity. Society has ruined people by getting them to do the absolute minimum to survive. If you work nine to five, or you work eight to six, or you work seven to seven, seven a.m. to seven p.m., believe me, it is nothing. It is the minimum necessary benchmark for survival. You cannot become successful until you build your capability and performance.